Poor Sylvia C in the UK is being tormented by a very active poltergeist in her home. Her YouTube channel documents these incidents. Here's one of the most recent. <laughs> Moving over there. Let's play again. <laughs> Sylvia says in the video that she's no longer addressing the spirit. I'm not speaking to it. I'm not speaking to it. Spirit kitchen. I'm not speaking. To it. But some in the comments don't think that's the best approach. Camera on close. Moving over there. Let's play again. I'm not speaking to it. I'm not speaking to it. Spirit Kitchen. I'm not speaking to it anymore. I'm not sure what the right course of action is in this situation, but if I were Sylvia, I'd worry about the poltergeist attaching itself to me. Some people run away from ghosts, others run toward them. TikToker Creppy Fasta shares this intense video of one courageous ghost hunter. Let's watch. Although he chases after the mischievous ghost, he doesn't catch him. Well, we didn't see the ghost in question. I believe he's there. He's just lucky he can make himself invisible. Have you ever seen a goblin? Well, you're about to in this video by YouTube channel Creepy Videos. The video is a bit blurry, but watch close to the wall behind the boy. Did you see it? <laughs> the creature wasn't behind the boy before, but seems to appear out of thin air. The boys don't see it at first, but when they do... <laughs> well, the video is too blurry to catch distinct details, whatever the creature is appears to be wearing a hat. It also stands upright on its feet to hurry away. I think this might actually be a goblin or other mythical creature. If only we could get a closer look. This ghost has a sense of humor. YouTuber Mystic Ghost shares a spirit box session with the comedian. <laughs> Hello. 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 So you don't mean us any harm then, huh? Did you say boo? Boo. <laughs> boo. <laughs> Are you Who knew that boo was a ghost's punchline? A moment later, the ghost starts his prop humor. What was that? What was that? Oh, it's this like helmet. Did you? Touch it, no? no, I didn't touch it. It was on the speaker, I thought. This spirit's a real comedic genius. I don't know about you, but I want to see his entire act. YouTube channel Casa Sobra Natural ventured into the house where no one sleeps, and after what they experienced there, they'll never sleep again themselves. <laughs> They later get a reading on their EMF meter, and it seems like their light is going berserk. As they attempt to speak with the spirits, a strange sound is heard, like something sliding across a table. The spirits give a name. In another room, they find a light on. Hey, okay. Oh, my God, what is that? 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 What is
Olha! Isso, olha isso, olha isso. Tá aceso, cara. Ah, não acredito. But there's no one in the room. Later, the light comes on again in that same room. Ô, velho. Apagou a luz, cara. Apagou a luz, cara. Foi nós sair da casa, apagou a luz. Nossa, velho. Apagou a luz, cara. Cara, But it's empty this time. Did the spirit here finally go to sleep? I think it's time to get some shut eye. YouTuber Donnie Drunkard is being haunted by aggressive demons. It started with the usual scratches in the night. <clears throat> Last night when the lightning started, I woke up. And I wasn't from Terry. And there's also the feeling. Here's how Donnie explains it. There's been a lot of that and a lot of, uh, I, guess, I guess, chatter. Some good, some bad. And I just don't know how to describe it. There's been times where I feel like some somebody's right behind me right now. Later in the clip, with EVPs abound, we're going to need to turn up the volume for this one. Oh, somebody heard something. I heard that. A scream. I heard a knock. I just heard a knock. I don't know. It's just... <sighs> There's a scream, a knock, and then what sounds like a woman crying. I guess, I guess chatter. Some good. I heard a knock. I just heard a knock. I don't know. Where are these EVPs coming from? Did their source also scratch up Donnie's arm? If Donnie doesn't live in a loud neighborhood, I have to believe that something dark is living in the house with him. This is a scary catch. The team at YouTube channel crazy about fishing and cooking were out fishing and cooking when they spotted something creepy in the woods. Watch between the trees. <laughs> Did you see it? It's hard to tell what it is. It's too dark to make out any details, but it looks to me like a shape-shifting creature. Then again, it could be an animal from this distance. What do you think it is? Dabbling in the dark arts has its consequences. CVS Paranormal analyzes this group's experience with a Ouija board in this scary video. And let's just say, it's not all fun and games. This video is originally from Curved TV. After a time of zero communication, the girls start to give up. I'm so done. Yeah, my arm Just hurts. Me, guys. There's no point. Until this happens. You did You're that. joking. You told me. <laughs> yeah, you did that. It was totally you. I'm not doing it. The planchette clearly moves on its own here. Only one of the players has her hand on it. This is where John comes in. I told you, Jay. I told you it wasn't me. Oh. According to CVS Paranormal, the spirit communicates his age and how he had his life taken by spelling out G U N. Thinking this must be a prank, one of the girls asks this Say something then. Say boo. Boo. <laughs> After something is thrown in the background, the ghost spells B-O-O. -O. I'm not sure I believe every detail, unless the spirit is incredibly active, but I do believe that you're asking for trouble when you play with a Ouija board. Things are literally out of your hands. While exploring an abandoned place, YouTube team terror Alex Stremo spots a terrible nightmare. You've heard of the lady in white. Well, how about the lady in black? They spot her again, hiding around a corner. Ay, como que vi que se movió algo. Hey. Sí, nos está viendo alguien. 
but eventually she disappears. They continue to explore the abandoned place, and it seems like they're being followed. <laughs> Then she appears again. But again, she escapes, only to scare them anew. The game of hide and seek continues. Until it culminates. In this. Who is this devil bride? I have no theories, but this team better escape before she makes one of them her eternal groom. Kathy is being haunted by a musical spirit. It's okay, honey. You heard it though, right? <gasps> oh my god! This isn't the only terrifying incident in her home. Watch this series of events play out. I'm hearing something. <gasps> oh, I'm wet inside. Oh, hey, my God. God. Oh, okay. oh, my God. Oh, my God. If there's one thing I know for sure, it's that Kathy is truly haunted, or it's just one of those things that viewers are struggling to explain. On Kathy's YouTube channel, Paranormal Nightmares, she shares more footage of the haunting taking place in her kitchen. The uploader said that she went to the basement to do laundry and when she came back upstairs, two cupboards were open and an ornament was rocking back and forth. She checked the security footage and this is what she found. The ornament continues rocking through the rest of the clip. To me, it definitely seems like this is a clear-cut case of poltergeist activity. At least it's not wreaking any more havoc. Or is it? Thank you so much for getting me to 20,000 subscribers here on my Clips channel. If you want to support, please press that subscribe button. Let's get to 30,000 subscribers next. Thank you.